Hey everyone, this is Mukesh Utwani once again from learnhibernation.com. This is another quick video for a small hack for Microsoft Edge browser. See, the moment you start working with Selenium and let's say if you have to do cross-browser testing, Chrome, Firefox, Safari, Edge, we can do that easily, right? But the moment you start working with Edge browser and once you're done with the loading application, you will see this small personalize your web experience option, right? where you have to click on got it, manage settings and so on. Sometimes this small pop-up can create an issue for you. Suppose you have some web elements which is coming uh, behind this personalized option. So when you try to perform some activity, you might come across some exception. So one option is you can quickly click on got it and continue. But what if you want to disable this option? Okay, because when you are running a fresh profile, you don't need any account. For example, if I open any session, it will ask you to use any specific profile, right? Profile one, if you want to add any account, you can use that account. Or if you have some signed up account, you can use that sign up account as well. But in order to work with Selenium, we don't need any profile. We don't need in an account, right? And I don't want this option to be enabled. So if you want to disable this, we will be using one simple argument called guest option which will basically hide this option for you. So if I show you manually first, then I will show you how to do this with the help of automation. For example, if I don't want any profile, if I go to other profiles and if I click on become or browse as guest, now you can see we have a guest profile. So in guest profile, you will not get that option personalize your web experience because it's a guest profile. So if you don't want that pop-up in Selenium, we can use one argument which is hyphen hyphen guest and then you will not get this kind of issue. So let me show you how you can do this very easy. So just to get started again, I will quickly write the code to start the edge browser. So I will write web driver driver equal to new edge driver. Okay. You will only get this option in edge. You are not getting this option with Firefox other browsers. So I will use webdriver driver called new edge driver. And the moment I use any application, okay, it is not dependent on any specific application. It's a browser option that we have. So irrespective of which application you use, you will see this option. So right now I have not used anything and it's launching edge browser here. Right now that option is not coming because the page is loading. Once page will load, you will see that option still loading we got the skip password option and now you can see we have personalized your web experience which can create issue while running your test so as i mentioned we can continue our test in a guest profile so in that case what you can do you can use a dedicated class called edge options so for every browser in selenium we have options class suppose you want to customize chrome we have Chrome options. If you want to customize Firefox, Firefox options. Same goes with Edge browser. If you want to change any preferences, settings, arguments, plugins, you can use Edge options class. They have given examples also how you can use it. So we'll quickly create one object of this. I will say Edge options opt equal to new Edge options. And once you create object, you can use opt.add argument. Now you can see here we have two methods. First method says you can pass list of string as an argument. Okay, suppose you have one argument, two argument, three argument. You can create a list and you can pass as an argument. Second option that you can see it's variable length argument where x you can see string dot dot dot. It means you can pass one argument, two arguments, multiple arguments. In this example, we just need one argument, which is hyphen hyphen guest. I will use hyphen hyphen guest. And once you're done with your options, you need to use these options in edge driver constructor. So the moment you create object of edge driver, right, you will see we have multiple constructor. So when you don't want to pass any option, we go with the default constructor with zero argument. Since we created one options now, we will use this and we'll pass this OPT. 
now if I execute this as you can see now it logged in with the guest profile since it logged in with the guest profile you will not get that option which is personalize your web experience and you can continue with the test so very quick hack but very useful uh, definitely it will help you when you are doing cross browser testing that's all about this video in case this video helped you in any manner then do support this channel share with your friends colleague subscribe to this channel and i will see you in the next video till then bye bye take care